Hi, Mariela. Hi, Andres Giovanni. Hi, teacher. Hi, Good evening. Teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm okay. I'm happy it's Friday. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. All right. Very good. And we have Magali. Hi, Magali. <laughs> Magali, le extrañamos ayer. I'm fine. <laughs> Very good. Hi, Juan Francisco. How are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Bye -bye. Excellent. Very nice. Welcome to class. Thank you. Excellent. Mariela, are you sick? Yes. You have the flu? Yes, I have a flu. Oh, no, Mariela. I'm sorry to hear that. Are you taking medicine? Thank you. Uh, yeah, tea. Okay, all right, that's good. Okay, I hope you get better soon, okay? ¿Cómo van con las tareas de la plataforma en lo que esperamos a los demás compañeros? Ay, yo no me acuerdo. ¿Por sí. dónde vamos ahorita? Eh, sería la tarea 15 ahora. Sí, ya terminé. ¿Ya terminó, Giovanni? Sí. Excellent. I finished. I finished too. Excellent. Section 3, Juan Francisco finished. Mm, yes. Excellent. Thank you. All right. Hi, Saul. Hi, Saul. Good evening. Oh, he's connecting. All right. Very good. Magali, can you hear me? Yes. All right. ¿Cómo va con la plataforma? ¿Se acuerda por qué tarea va, Magali? No, no me acuerdo, pero creo que me falta desde el martes. Ah, ok. All right. Pero sí, ya, ya um, empezó la, la sección 3, entonces. El examen sí ya lo terminé. Este, esa semana sí no, no lo he terminado, me hace falta. Ok, very good. Ok. Igual yo reviso mañana eh, en la tarde para ver cómo van. Ok, so ahí vamos a estar escribiendo en caso eh, para recordarles. To finish. All right. Very good. Thank you. Okay. So Saul is here. Carla is getting in. All right. Very good. That's nice. Carlita, me escucha? Yes, teacher. I hear you. Hi. How are you today, Carla? Good I'm evening, fine. Saul. Good. Very good. Carla, do you remember with uh, the platform, which number are you working on? Like, which number did you finish? No, Saul, do you, what about you, Saul? Carlita, your microphone is off. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Saul. That's okay, Carla. ¿Ya terminó la 15, Mariela? Sí. Super. ya tenemos tres que terminaron las sexy, las sexy. Entonces, dígame, Carlita. Tonight, are we going to work uh, the last homework? Okay, all right, very good. So that means, Carla, that you finish homework 14. No, 11. Ah, uh, oh, uh, what happened? <laughs> but today, but, but today finished. So. All right, that's okay. That's okay. All right. What about Saul? Saul, do you remember how you are on the platform already? Uh, my, my, my homework, uh, yo hice en la mañana la 14. Excellent, Saul. Okay, so entonces estamos casi que al día, ¿verdad? Sí, sí, Excellent, Saul. Very nice. Thank you for that. Okay, guys, so today is Friday and today is um, class number 15. And then we will have five more classes next week and we finished. All right. So that was like very, very quick. All right. So um, and then we're going to hopefully begin next um, the next course after that. Okay. So uh, yesterday, guys, we were reviewing the very last topic about email and formal emails. All right. And then we started talking about working etiquette. All right. Remember the etiquettes are, or they are um, rules that we can follow, that we should follow at work. We mentioned some, like for example, Juan Francisco told us yesterday to be on time. 
like to be punctual, that is an etiquette from work, right? Uh, creo que el cita nos hablaba de the, the way we dress, all right? That's also etiquette. Eh, mencionamos like the makeup usage. In some companies, you need to look like, you know, you need to wear a lot of makeup. And in some others, not so much, all right? Carla we, um, was mentioning to us that one of the rules or like work etiquette at the restaurants is to wash their hands all the time because they handle food all right i yes. guess part of the uniform carla would be the net right like the hair net that they have to wear that's part of the uniform carla? yes okay mm -hmm. so it's mandatory it's an obligation for them to wear it yes yes teacher okay very good so in every place we have different um working or work etiquettes depending on the type of business Type of company all right that it will depend on that so that's what we were studying yesterday para magali que no nos pudo acompañar ayer pero ya está con nosotros estuvimos un poquito eh, ayer eh, eh, magali about etiquette at work vamos a igual a recordar eh, con el manual solo déjeme tomar la primera asistencia de la noche esperando que los demás compañeros se nos unan a medida va pasando el tiempo andrés giovanni valdivia soportivo Present, Soy la Noemi Córdoba de Valencia. She's not here. Deme un segundito, please, please. All right, very good. Uh, Soy la Noemi Córdoba de Valencia, no yet. Eh, Yamileto Sorio Alfaro. Candelaria del Tránsito Martínez Cisneros, Alfredo Mengíbar Pineda, Carla, Carla, eh, Marta Cano Rivas, Here. Mayra Yasmín Rodríguez García, Hola. Hi Noemi. Hi, teacher. Thank you for being in class. Acabo de mencionar su nombre. Soy la Noemi Córdoba de Valencia. Present. Thank you. Thank All right. You. Uh, Fabiola Georgina Silva. Fabi no ha entrado. All right. Thank you. Uh, let me see. Eh, Juan Francisco Enriquez González. Present, teacher. Uh, Elsa Yanet de María. And uh, Ramirez Navarro, she's not in. What happened to Elcita today? Uh, Marcos Giovanni Moran Flores, Werner Mauricio Reyes Angel, Jennifer Magali Morales Guzman. Present. Thank you. Carlos Jonathan Garcia Alvarado, Jorge Antonio Hernández Cruz, Francisco Javier Villatoro Canales, Mariela de Los Ángeles Alvarado Díaz. Present. Thank you, Mariela. And Jose Saul Gonzalez Roque. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, let me see. Okay, very good. So hopefully uh, the rest of your classmates will join us tonight. Okay, so as we were seeing yesterday, this is what we studied. Let's go to your book, okay? So we, uh, we were talking about this. Remember that we read this article about this good etiquette at the workplace, okay? And the first paragraph, if you remember, it talks about being punctual. Lo que decía Juan Francisco, ¿verdad? Llegar a tiempo al trabajo. Y aquí, in this article, they told us about a system. Tarde, call your supervisor, okay? Uh, then here we have um, etiquette. It's also important when communicating uh, or when sending emails to other countries, okay? You need to know their protocol. You need to know the way they type emails. In the other paragraph right here, we talked about um, when you talk on the phone, it's very important for you to be clear and concise and speak like nice and uh, you need to like go to the point and be polite all right on the last paragraph we talked about uh, general guidelines when you are with your co-workers maybe not in the office but somewhere else but you need to behave and if you get like a phone call from someone else 
then you just kind of say, excuse me, and then you get your phone call, all right? So that was pretty much what the article talked about yesterday. Y con eso hicimos las cuatro preguntas que estábamos acá. All right, so today, guys, we're going to go right away to our groups, okay? Now, what I want you to do, this is what I want you to uh, guys to do. Just give me a second. I need to see something here. All right, okay. So what I want you to do right now, guys, is to work on an etiquette manual, all right, like um, a brief manual of the year 2021, all right? So think about... Um, if you're gonna to go to your groups, okay? And then I want you to come up with your own etiquette, okay? Come up with your own rules. Piense, pues, por ejemplo, yo estoy trabajando con Mariela. Obviamente, Mariela y yo trabajamos en dos empresas diferentes, okay? Eh, pero vamos a crear nuestra empresa, Mariela, okay? So, eso vamos a hacer primero. Primero vamos a crear nuestra empresa y decidimos si es de turismo, por decir algo, okay? Es un hotel con Mariela. Le vamos a poner hasta el nombre y le ponemos Mariela. Uh, después de eso, so you're going to be famous, Mariela, all right? Pensamos en nuestra etiquette, all right? El tipo de etiqueta o de reglas que vamos a seguir en nuestro hotel, que nuestros empleados, porque nosotros somos las dueñas, Mariela, okay? <laughs> all right, so we want them to follow rules, okay? Entonces, vamos a pensar en 10 etiquette, all right? Etiquette rules, 10. Ahí dicen dice 6, but we're going to do 10 today, okay? So, uh, for example, number one, greet everyone in the facilities, all right? Facilities is like the place where you work, okay? So everybody has to say good morning, good evening, how are you, welcome, all right? Especialmente que es un hotel, all right? So everybody has to say, you know, talk to the clients, okay? ¿Qué otras cosas eh, podríamos escoger con Mariela que sean etiquetas o reglas que tienen nuestros empleados que seguir? trabajando en el hotel. Entonces, lo primero que tienen que hacer es piensen una compañía eh, que ustedes quieran, all right, invéntense una, póngale nombre y luego basado en eso piense, ok, este es nuestro rubro, all right, so which etiquettes should we have in our workplace, ok? Do you guys understand? Yes? Yes, yes, Excellent. Very good. Okay, so here we go, guys. We're going to go right now to our groups so you guys can start. Y vamos a tener un grupo de tres. All right, oh, por ahorita. But that's okay. So Andres, Giovanni, Carla, Marta, and Noemi, you're going to be in one group. Saul and Jennifer Magali in the other group. And Juan Francisco with Mariela in group number three. Okay? Okay. En, en eso tal vez entran más compañeros y se unen igual a otros grupos.
Hi, Edgar Longro, entrar. Yes, teacher. Thank you. Ok, very good. Um, Edgar, ahorita los compañeros se acaban de ir a los grupos porque van a hacer un manual. No un manual, sino que una lista de um, etiquettes. All right. Vamos a crear nuestra propia empresa. Por ejemplo, con Mariela inventamos un hotel. Ahora right, Mariela y yo somos las dueñas, ¿verdad? Entonces vamos a tener, vamos a pensar en 10 etiquettes que los empleados o nuestros empleados tienen que seguir en the hotel. All right. Lo voy a asignar a un grupo ahorita y se acopla, acaban de irse, ¿ok? Entonces se acopla usted ahí al, uh, al business que ya crearon ellos, ¿ok? O les ayuda a crear uno. <risa> Thank you, Edgar. And que mm -hmm. no, no olvidar, don't forget. Be polite. Don't forget, uh -huh. don't forget be polite. Vaya, vamos cuatro. Qué rápido somos, bitch. <laughs> Vaya, las cinco sería algo así como... Si decimos algo así como algo, tu frase de todos los días. ¿Cuál? Tu frase de todos los días. Es, permítame, disculpen, voy a contestar okay. a una llamada sobre el trabajo. Es, ok, está. Es, you know.
Sorry. So, okay. Se, eh, eh, trabajaron en una. <ríe> Ahí van a disculpar. No, esperando hasta. Ah, clase. ok. Este, si me gusta que sea moneda sin falta. Este, no, 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 no. Don't forget to be polite, dijimos, ¿verdad? Hola, Noé. Hola, hola. Tal vez es una de. Hola. Se escucha, se le escucha contar. Sí, hola. Un, tal vez pensaba en que dijéramos algo así como en el uso del teléfono en público ah sí o en, en los, con los clientes no o, o mantén mantén como mantén guardado tu o no utiliza tu teléfono después de horas laborales Ajá. use your phone Ajá. After your, your journal, ¿cómo es que se dice? <laughs> journal, work, journal, hours. Ya ni me acuerdo cómo es que se dice. Journal. Pero um, sí está bien esa, ¿verdad? Es, permítame. Ajá, sí. Esa me parece sí. bien. Lo siento, es que el trabajo me está llamando. Vaya, este, quedamos en que no usáramos el teléfono, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Me estoy dando el ejemplo de eso, lo siento. Don't use your phone. Don't use your phone. Your phone in, in, ¿Cómo dicen horas laborales? In the labor, in journal hours. Working hours. Ah, el teacher, ahí está, qué oso. Working hours. Oh, working hours. Ay, no, qué momento. Y la última, last one, sería... Cinco, de este mm. uh, reportarse de que bárbara say goodbye at, uh, before before the, you go out you qué you go out cómo se dice cómo salir verdad uh -huh. antes de que salgas before you go out go. Out the world. Out. Creo yo, creo. Ajá. O podríamos decir salir del restaurante. Uh, out. Uh, Carla, what's the question? ¿Cómo se dice? What is the English word for eh, salir del antes de salir del restaurante? Before leaving work. Ah, nice. <laughs> Thank you, Tish. You're welcome. Before leaving 
Say goodbye before leaving before new work. New work. Carlita, ¿y será que lo podrá compartir en el chat? I guess she didn't hear you, Noe. Carlita. Carla. Noemí le preguntaba si lo podía compartir en el chat. Ah. Pero... Lo siento, sí, este, claro, con mucho gusto. <risa> Thank you, Carlita. <risa> Lo voy a escribir. <risa> Sorry, chicha. That's okay, Carla. My job can't live with, without me. I know, I understand. <risa> You're very important, Carla. <risa> The restaurant is still open, Carla. Sorry? Ah, yes, yeah. Well, yes, what time until, do they close? Until 9 p.m. Downtown? Yeah. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Wow. Always, every day, Carla. No. Um, Sunday until Thursday, Tuesday. Uh, we we closed at uh, 8 p.m. Friday and Saturday till nine. Yeah, at 9 p.m. Okay. Wow, interesting. Mm -hmm. En estos momentos lo estoy eh, escribiendo en el Thank chat. Thank you. And say hello. Thank you. Every, every one. Okay. Ya, ya se lo vi, ya se lo vi. Ah, perfecto. Thank you, Giovanni. Thank you. Sí, gracias, mamá. Okay. Okay. Va a entrar Marcos ahorita con nosotros. Ok. Hi, okay. Marcos. Giovanni. Can you read me the last one? The last one. Say goodbye before leaving work. Marcos Leave no se escucha. Work. Marcos, Marcos. Leaving work. Uh -huh. Leaving, leaving work. No escucha quizá. No escucha, ¿verdad, Marco? ¿O no me escucharán? No, Marco. Sí, creo que no. no está bien, serio. Está He's very concentrated. Está concentrado. I know. Hi, Marcos. Hola, buenas noches. ¿No se escucha, escucha, Marcos? Ahorita sí. Sí, se escucha. No, ah, Marcos. sí, ahora sí los escucho, es que no los escuchaba. Ok, very good. Perdón, Estaba... buenas noches. Estábamos viendo que está bien concentrado, Marco. Es que viendo esto del... <risa> del del micrófono. All right, very good. Marcos, ahorita los compañeros Carla, eh, Noemí y Andrés Giovanni están creando una lista de 10 reglas de etiqueta que tendrían que seguir en un restaurante. Carla, ese es el rubro. In a restaurant. Yes, teacher. Okay. Entonces, ellos ya tienen 5 o 6, me parece, y la idea es que tengan 10. All right, entonces ahí eh, puede escuchar y luego... Ah, 10. Ya, ya. Ajá. Son 10, Giovanni. Ya. ¿Ok? Yo aquí estoy ah, calladita okay. viéndolos trabajar. <risa> Me imagino okay. que estas que has enviado aquí en el, en oh. el chat son, Giovanni. Las que llevan, las 5. Son... Ajá. 6. Ah, 6, Giovanni. Ya, sí, 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 perdón. Ajá. Sí, sí. Vale. Entonces faltan cuatro. 
en un restaurante. Mm. No poner los codos en la mesa. Um, Ey, esa pero, es etiqueta, de verdad. Eh, sí, pero... No, este... ya, ya, estoy bromeando. Ya estoy medio <risa> tratando de... Porque lo estamos relacionando con el restaurante Ajá. y los clientes. Uh -huh. Entonces, de la atención. Que sea, o sea, ser siempre eficiente con los clientes o algo así. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yo tengo, ay, te voy a mandar una foto. Wow. Tengo... Oh, wow. Hi, She's here. Tengo... <laughs> ah, sí. Good evening, teacher. Hi, Francisco Javier. How are you? Fine, thank you. What about you? I'm fine. Thank you. Okay, that's nice. Mariana, did you call me for help? Yes. What happened? ¿Cómo se dice temperatura? <laughs> temperatura de fiebre. Tengo esa duda existencial ahorita. Uh, you can say sí. fever or temperature. 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 Uh, tomar okay. the temperature. Solo esa necesita. Take the temperature. All right. Take the temperature. 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 Okay. Uh -huh. Ya terminamos. Teacher, nice glass. Thank you. <laughs> All right, mm -hmm. very good. So okay. what is the uh, what is the uh, business, Mariela, Juan Francisco, and Francisco Javier? Oh, a uh, restaurant. <laughs> restaurant. Oh, okay. All right. Very good. So, what are the? Uh, did you come up with ten etiquette rules? Yes. Okay. Can you? Can I hear some of them? Juan Francisco, you read three. Francisco Javier, you read three, and then Mariela, you read four. Okay. Okay. Uh, number one, mm -hmm. get everyone in the restaurant. Okay. Uh, be nice to the customer. He always wear the uniform clean. Yeah, all right. So can you read the second one, please? Uh, be nice to the customer. Be nice to the customer, to. To the customer. Uh -huh. yeah. Okay, thank you. All right, very good, thank you. Uh, Francisco Javier, the other three, please. To the customer. Okay. Um, respect the entry time. Oh, okay. Always wear the uniform clean. Mm -hmm. Take your temperature, temperature when temperature. you stay at work. Temperature okay, temperature when you stay at work. work. All right, very good. Okay, nice. And Mariela, what are the other four? Okay, um, wash your hand constantly. Constantly, yes. Uh huh. Mandatory, mandatory use of mask. Okay. Take care of your personal presentation. Okay. And Keep facilities clean and follow protocols. Oh, very good. All right. Okay. Very nice. Cool. Very good. Okay. So uh, I was in another group like before I came to yours and they were missing like two. All right. So let's wait for like one more minute and then we're going to go back and share the, um, the etiquettes. All right. From everybody. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Thank you guys. I'll see you in one minute. Wow. Hi, Magali. Hi. Did you finish, Magali? Uh, no. No? How many did we you We have five. Only five? Okay, that's fine. That's okay. All right, that's fine. You were working with Edgar and... Well, Winner is Saul. Saul. All right, okay, very good. Okay. Hoy sí, me gusta más, ya vinieron más, ya estaba preocupado por Marcos, Francisco Javier, que no habían entrado. Ajá. 
eh, cómo se escribe o se dice eh, la redecilla que usan en la cabeza. Uh, hairnet. Um, hairnet. Net. Hairnet. Uh -huh. Ah, ok. Mm -hmm. All right, yep, yeah. that's the one they use on their heads. All right, very good. So, um, Magali, Edgar, Werner, and Saul, what is the business that you guys created or chose? <laughs> Which one did you choose? A hotel. A hotel, all right, very good. Okay, so Magali, you tell me two. Edgar, you tell me uh, one. Werner, you tell me one more. And Saul, you tell me the last one, okay? Okay. In the Hotel Magali, we show respect to all people. Excellent, Magali's <laughs> Hotel. Let's listen to that, guys. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> okay, so you should respect everyone, all right? Okay, so respect everyone. All right, Magali, very good. What's the other one? Uh, in the Hotel Magali, we accept pet. Oh, okay. All right. But is that an etiquette, Magali? Guys, is that an etiquette? Etiquette. Or no. Or that is a um, feature of the hotel. That is one of the benefits of the hotel. Because remember <laughs> that, yeah. Because yeah. remember that right now, etiquettes are like rules that employees <laughs> have to follow. Right? Uh, okay. Okay. Very good. And let, let's continue. Edgar, give me another one. Okay. Uh, Hotel Magali, we have effective communication and honesty. Okay. So you need to be, as an employee, you need to have effective communication and you need to be honest. Okay. All right. Honesty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, Hotel Magali always characters as punctuality. Ah, okay. Okay, it characterizes as, as punctual. All right, very good. Okay, let's see. Uh, Werner or Saul, can you tell me one more? In the Hotel Magali, our social commitment is with environment. Okay, all right. So you are environmentally friendly hotel. All right. So every like all your employees need to be like environmental friendly kind of or responsible with the environment kind of thing. Yeah. All right, very good. Where did another one or that was the last one? Uh, esas fueron todas, teacher. Where did porque están oscuro ahora, ¿qué le pasó? Ya ya estoy cargando el teléfono, teacher. Ya <laughs> Ok, bueno, era tú, ok. All right, very good. Mire que de verdad que hoy ahí tengo varios de incógnitos. Andrés, Mariela, Noé, a Saúl porque la camarita, ¿verdad? Pues ya sabemos. Ahí está Noé, thank you. All right, Mariela, very good. Thank you, guys. Ok, nice. Um, let me see. Francisco Javier, you were working with Juan Francisco and Mariela. Ok. So, um, you guys were, what was the company that you guys chose? Or which type of company was it? Which type of company? Uh, why? Our company is a restaurant. Okay, very good. Does your restaurant have a name, uh, Francisco Javier? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the name? The new old, old town. Okay, <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, so what are your working etiquettes? Or what is your working etiquette? Francisco Javier, your, your, um, your microphone. Um, be nice to the customer. Mm -hmm. Wear your head up to avoid accident. Okay. Respect the entry time. Okay. Uh, always wear the uniform frame. Okay. Take your temperature. Temperature uh, when you stay at work. Yeah. Take your temperature. Uh huh. Temperature. Okay. Wash your hands constantly. Yeah. Wash your hands constantly, especially now. Uh huh. All right, anything okay. else? Uh huh. Mandatory use of mask. Okay. Perfect. Uh, take care of your personal presentation. Okay. Keep facilities clean and follow protocols. Excellent, right, very good. Nice, 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 nice. Very good, thank you guys. 
Let's see. Carla, eh, Marcos, Giovanni, and Noemi, right? So uh, which, which type of company did you guys choose? Restaurant teacher. Restaurant, okay, very good. And Giovanni, can you tell Restaurant us? Too. Okay, mm -hmm. very good. So can you tell us a little bit about your pro oh, I mean, your etiquette at work? Okay, uh, we just have six teachers. Okay, that's fine. Uh, uh, attend and say hello to everyone. Okay. Wash your hands when you start and finish an activity. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's important to be punctual. Okay. Don't forget, always be polite. Okay. Don't use your phone in working hours. Oh, all right. Okay. Mm -hmm. And say goodbye before leaving work. Okay. Very good. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I guess most of your companies, I mean, it doesn't really matter, guys, what type of company you have. We deal with customers all the time. All right. If it's a restaurant, if it's I don't know, a clinic, if it's a hotel, if it's teaching, I mean, whatever we do, we deal with customers, all right? And I think it's very, very important for every employee of that company, it doesn't matter which one, to be respectful and to be like, you know, like treating the customer as the most important that you have, all right? So you need to say hello you need to smile you need to be respectful all right you need to be like i don't know aware that you are working for someone all right so you have to value that so customers are very very important all right so we need to have like you we need to be very very friendly all the time all right so i think that's one of the best things that any company can have so people feel value and they feel happy and they come back to the company all right because sometimes we go to companies and you say good morning y nadie le contesta, right? If you're like, oh, what happened here, verdad? Y de repente así de, uy, qué feo. <laughs> All right, so saying good morning is very important. Or smiling, porque de repente así usted llega y le dice, eh, llega donde Juan Francisco y, y Juan Francisco está serio, ¿verdad? Yo le digo, hi, y él solo va a decir, bueno, hi. <laughs> así como, what do you want, right? And that shouldn't be like that, okay? You are a company and you are offering no importa el producto o el, o el servicio que usted esté brindando, you need to be polite and you need to smile. All right. So I think that's very, very important uh, for um, any company to have. ¿verdad? Entonces, eh, más de alguna vez hemos entrado a algún lugar donde usted se siente así como no bienvenido o bienvenida y no regresa. All right, you don't, you don't want to go back to that company. Se siente así como, I'm not going to go back there. All right, I need people to treat me right. I'm paying for a service. All right, so I deserve to be treated nicely. Very good, guys. Let's see. Let's continue here with the uh, book. All right, so we just did this. All right, so let's go back here. Communication at the workplace, okay? So we have find, we have some vocabulary practice, okay? Communication and etiquette, okay? So here we have, these are the words, etiquette, punctual, guidelines, latecomer, polite, behavior, manners, salutation, regards, and subject, okay? Eh, no vamos a hacer la sopa de letras igual que la vez pasada because most of you don't have it printed out and we have it here, all right? So we cannot really do it together. But we, we are going to do the following. We have um, these sentences, I mean, these words, and we're going to make sentences. Pero esta vez no nos vamos a ir a los grupos, sino que lo vamos a hacer ahí en casita. A ver, dos, cuatro, seis, ocho, diez. Escojan, no sé, escoja tres, any three, all right? Cual, que, eh, not, mm, ¿Cómo le digo? No, not everybody's going to have the same three sentences. For example, Francisco Javier can choose etiquette, latecomer, and polite. Edgar is going to choose maybe manner, salutation, and punctual. All right? Trate, ¿sabe qué? Quiero que trate de escoger una que nunca ha usado. Es más, que ni sabía que quería decir hasta últimamente, en estos días. ¿Ok? Porque escogemos la que ya conocemos o la más fácil. All right? Pues no, hoy no. Escojamos de la más difícil. A ver qué oración nos puede salir usando ese vocabulario. All right? So, 
Vamos a estar aquí, eh, no nos vamos a ir a los grupos, lo vamos a hacer individual. Piense, escoja tres de estas diez. All right, and make sentences. Trate de hacerlo en pasado o trate de hacerlo en presente. Or use would, all right? Or would you mind or could, cualquiera de eso. Póngalo en oración, okay? Let me know when you finish.
All right, guys, did you finish? Or not yet? All right, Francisco Javier, finish. Juan Francisco, finish. Andres? Yes. All right, very good. What about the rest of you guys? Werner, Saul, Edgar, Marcos? Solo tres, teacher. Yeah, only three. Very good. Carlita, Magali, Mariela, and Noemi, finished? Finished. I have excellent all right okay yeah only three right now only three i just wanted you to do three sentences with three uh, words okay let's see um giovanni can you tell us your three sentences um well the word and then the three sentences that you have okay um, the first the first is we should learn to be punctual Ah, oh, we should learn to be punctual. Okay. Very good. Okay. In our company, we always are polite. He, he forgot to type the subject in the email. Very good. Tell me sentence number two, Andres, please. In our company, we always are polite. I don't know if it's called. In our company, our, our company we are always polite. We in our company, polite. we are always polite. Okay. Uh -huh. yes. Yeah, very good. Thank you. Very good. Let's see. Mariela, tell me your three sentences. <clears throat> always maintain a good behave, behavior. No sé cómo se pronuncia. Behavior. Behavior, Mariela. Behavior. Behavior, behavior. behavior. Yes. Always maintain good behavior. Uh -huh. And always keep etiquette at work. Nice. And okay. Be, bink, bink, no sé cómo se pronuncia, bink. Uh -huh. Bink, puntual, is important for everything. Uh, bean, 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 punctual, is important for everything. Very good. Excellent, Mariela. Nice sentences. Thank you. All right, Saul, what do you have for your three sentences? Uh, number one, mm -hmm. uh, in my work, we, uh, we strive to be punctual. Ah, okay. Very good. Nice sentence. Oh, very good. You strive to be punctual. Uh -huh. Number two, mm -hmm. at my work, we arrive early. Okay. Only, only two. Only two? All right. Very good. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's okay. Ah, oh, Mariela, you have a cat. Very good. All right, let's see. Werner, what are your three sentences? Uh, yo lo hice de esta forma, teacher. Mm -hmm. um, um, my company, all, all you workers are very polite. 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 The rating okay. is very important in your trainer, training plus your punctuality. Oh, very good. Nice. Okay, good. Good for you. Very nice. Let's see. Magali, what do you have for your sentences? Uh, we we give the guys line for this report. Ah, we did the uh, guidelines. She hate bad... uh -huh. uh, and she hates bad um, men. There's... Okay. De los modales, no sé. 
manners and manners uh, manners uh, she hates bad manners ah okay she hates bad manners uh huh <laughs> okay we included late late comers okay. the late comers late comers yes late comers yeah, very good okay yeah mm -hmm. late comers are the people that arrive late all right very good nice okay. uh, Marcos, uh, mm -hmm. Marcos Giovanni can you tell us your sentences please okay teacher yes eh, me imagino que vamos a hacer oraciones, Patichero. Yes, Marcos, yes, sentences. Porque yo, bueno, yo hice. Uh, I must be how well am um, I working hours? You should behave no, well on your working hours. Sí, hours. Okay, yes, no sé si está bien. No, it's okay. Y yeah. I must be punctual in my work. Excellent. You must be punctual in your work, Marcos. Very nice. Y I must how cool ma manners. manners. No such yes. manners. Manners, yes. Very With good. Clients. With clients. Very With clients. good, Marcos. Nice sentence. Very good. Well done. Solo esas tres hizo, Excellent. Sé que solo tres pedí. That's okay. <laughs> Very nice. Let's see. Uh, Francisco Javier, tell us your sentences. Okay, we need to have manners to attend our clients. Good. Our employees have two good lines of work that they have to use. Okay. Every employee have to give rigors to others. Okay. All right. Very nice. Nice sentences, Francisco. Thank you. Let's see. Noemi, can you tell us your sentences? Noe, Noe. All right, while we wait, maybe uh, Edgar, tell us your sentences. Yeah, teacher. Uh, punctuality is one of the first service of the company. Nice. Uh huh. Uh, all newcomers to the company welcome, welcome you. Okay. Uh, integrity is one of the behaviors. In the company behaviors behaviors Behavior. uh -huh. behaviors okay okay all right nice very good Edgar very nice sentences all right Noemi está por ahí todavía no Noe oh I guess not um Carla did you tell us your sentences already no right okay teacher uh, your behavior says a lot of your personality excellent sentence and I agree with that. <laughs> it's very important know your own guidelines. Say it again, Carlita. It's very important mm -hmm. know your own guidelines. Okay, it is very important to know. To know. To know, yeah. Mm -hmm. And the last one, always write the subject line with a topic relevant to your destinatory. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's good. Uh, it's the uh, recipient. Uh, yeah, sorry, <laughs> I no, forget that's okay. it. No, that's fine, that's fine. Very good. Yeah, recipient, remember, is the one that is going to receive your email. All right, very good, Carla. Nice sentences. Very good, guys. Thank you. Super good sentences. I'm very proud of all of you, right? Uh, obviamente hay compañeros que se han integrado en el camino y no han visto el proceso. De repente tengo a Werner y a Marcos que entraron en el módulo 1 y, y, y pues nada, venían bien básicos, ¿verdad Marcos? ¿Se acuerda que usted estaba así como que ya no sigo en el 2 mejor, decía Marcos? <ríe> y ya llegó al 3, all right, so that's very nice and I can see your process Marcos, very, debe, debe sentirse muy orgulloso Marcos. Werner obviamente Gracias, y todos teacher. pues, pero digo, me refiero a los dos compañeros porque vienen conmigo desde el módulo 1 Y venimos viendo el ABC, ¿verdad? Y Marcos decía que le costaba el ABC dar. Imagínense ahora ya está haciendo oraciones así bien nice. Super, 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 right? I, I'm very proud of you guys. Thank you for that. Okay.
Let's continue here. Vamos a tomar la asistencia eh, de la segunda parte. All right. Let's see. We have um, Andrés Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Soy la Noemi Córdoba de Valencia. Present. Thank you. Uh, Jamileto Sorio Alfaro. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Can, uh, Candelaria El Tránsito Martínez Cisneros. Edgar Alfredo Mengíbar Pineda. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Carla Marta Cano Rivas. Here. Very good. Eh, Mayra Yasmín Rodríguez García. Marvel Omar Ramírez Vázquez. Fabiola Georgina Silva. Juan Francisco Enríquez González. Present teacher. Elsie Anet de María Ramírez Navarro. Marcos Giovanni Morán Flores. Present teacher. Werner Mauricio Reyes Ángel. Present teacher. Thank you. Jennifer Magali Morales Guzmán. Present. Carlos Jonathan García Alvarado. Jorge Antonio Hernández Cruz. All right, very good. Um, Francisco Javier Villatoro Canales. Present. Very good. Mariela Los Ángeles Alvarado Díaz. Present teacher. And Jose Saul uh, Gonzalez Roque. Present teacher. Very good, guys. Thank you. All right. Let's see. Let's continue then here with this. Um, all right. Eh, pregunto nada más. Todo el vocabulario que está ahí, eh, los que no, las, uh, las palabras que no usaron, ¿saben qué quieren decir? ¿Entendemos qué quiere decir cada una hora? Revision. Yes. Late, late comers. Uh -huh. Late comers are the people that arrive late, Andres Giovanni. For example, if I always come like to my job at, I don't know, yo entro a las 7, but I always arrive at 7.30, 7.45, 7.15, 7.20, every day. Entonces a mí me catalogan como una late comer, all right? That I'm always late. I'm always coming late. All right. Entonces usted dice, ah, Jessica es a latecomer. Entonces se sobreentiende que siempre llega tarde. All right. Siempre, sure. siempre, siempre. Yes. Y, y la diferencia entre eh, salutation y reward. Esta. Uh, Esa. Sí, sí. Reward y salutation. Y yeah, ya, salutation es como saludo. All right. Y bueno, reward. Regards es. Regards. Uh, esa ya la usamos como, como ¿cómo se llama? Eh, cuando nos despedimos, ¿verdad? Eh, lo que pasa es que saludos de adiós. Salutation ah. es el greeting. All right. Pero regards, cuando usted dice best regards o mejores saludos o solo saludos, pero eso ya lo ponemos en el closing. Salutation, se entendemos que es greetings, and regards es cuando nos despedimos. Oh, okay, teacher. All right, yes. very good, very good question, um, Werner. De repente es como que los dos quieren decir saludo y entonces. <laughs> All right, so it's like, yeah, very good. So salutation, véalo como greetings. Y cuando hablamos de greetings, hablamos de hi, hello, dear mister, dear missus, dear miss. All right. Um, esa sería salutation y a regards es cuando ya usted se despide después de la carta, el documento o el, el correo en este caso All right. y dice regards All right. regards, ahí luego pone su nombre All right. ok Werner yes teacher excellent, very good All right. um, any other question, any other vocabulary guys No, everything okay? A ver, let's talk about pronunciation ahora. A ver, eh, tenemos etiquette, all right, guidelines. Esa la, nos costaba un poco ayer, no sé si les cuesta todavía. Guidelines, all right. Polite is not polite, is not polite, is polite. Manners, regards. Punk, is not punctual, is pa, punctual. All right, latecomer, behavior, esa cuesta un poquito, behavior, salutation, and subject, okay? 
Yes. A ver, Mariela, regáleme la pronunciación de las 10 palabras que están ahí. Mariela, please. <coughs> Etiquette. Mm -hmm. Guidelines. Yes. Polite. Manners. Regards. Punctual. Latecomer. Behavior. Salutation. Subject. Very good, very good. All right, Andres Giovanni, what about your um, 10 words, please? Okay, uh, etiquette, mm -hmm. guidelines, mm -hmm. polite, manners, regards, function, late comment, behavior, mm -hmm. salutation, and subject. And subject, perfect, very good. A ver, otro voluntario o voluntaria to tell me the words, please. Teacher? Yeah. Thank you, uh-huh. Okay. Etiquette. Mm -hmm. Guidelines, polite, yeah. ma manner, man manners, 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 yes, manners, 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 uh -huh. regards, punctual, yeah. late call, be behavior, sal salutation, subjects. A ver, very good. Edgar, a ver, punctual, punk, punk, como que fuera punk. Punk, uh, uh, punk. Punctual, uh -huh. punctual, 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 very good. Punctual, punctual. uh huh. Uh, tenemos behavior. Behavior. Behavior, very good. Eh, y salutation. Salutation. Very good. All right, nice, Edgar, very good. All right, another one, another volunteer to tell me the words. Me. Okay, tell me. Etiquette. Uh -huh. Guidelines. Polite. Okay. Okay. Manners. Regard. Punctual. Regards. 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 Uh -huh. Regards, very good. Punctual. Very good. Latecomer. Mm -hmm. Behavior. Salutation and subject. Very good. Okay. Behavior. 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 Excellent. Very good. Nice. Behavior. Very good, Francisco. Thank you. All right. And one more, the last one. One more volunteer to tell me the words. Um etiquette. Okay. Um Get the light. Guidelines. Guidelines. Uh -huh. Like. Yes. Manuals. Yes. Regard. Very good. Punctual. No, punctual. Punctual. Lo como que fuera awareness. Punk. Punctual. 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 Excellent. Uh -huh. Le sale mejor. Punctual. Very good. Uh -huh. Latecomer. Yes. Behavior. 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 Excellent. Salutation. Very good. Subject. Subject. Very good, guys. Thank you for that. Very nice. Okay. So, acuérdense que la idea es, like, you guys have to pronounce and then uh, yeah. check your pronunciation. All right? Let's see. Let me just see something here. Okay. We're going to do this exercise right now, guys. Okay? Remember that it, the, this is the last day for um, Section 3 or Unit 3. So we're going to be uh, doing like a review right now of what we have seen. So for number three, would you mind or could you? ¿Se acuerda que lo vimos al principio de la semana? Ahí está la indicación. Eso lo va a hacer usted con su grupo. Eh, o sea, voy a rehacer grupos porque hay más compañeros. Eh, igual, con la persona que usted quede asignada, hace el número tres, igual el número cuatro. Select the most appropriate answer for the request below. All right, so son requests, y aquí están las posibles respuestas. All right, write a suggestion about the following behaviors. Okay, entonces aquí va, van a escribir sugerencias sobre los comportamientos que están acá. One, two, three, four, and five. All right, luego va a ser esto, vamos a trabajar en esto. Eh, number six, classify these salutations and closing into formal or informal. Aquí hay una lista y va, lo va a poner en la categoría de la category of formal or the category of informal. No sé si le van a tomar foto, necesitan tomarle foto para que puedan trabajar en los grupos o no sé si lo tienen ahí. ¿Qué página es, teacher? Uh, 38, Edgar, 38. ¿Alguien necesita tomarle foto o no lo tienen? I got it. Excellent. All right. Y de este también, number five and six. Okay. Very good. I think everybody's got it. 
Voy a dejar de compartir y voy a volver a hacer grupos para que quedemos. All right, okay. Let's go, guys. It's two per group, all right? So just working with a partner.
Hi guys, what number are you working on? Yeah, the number. The number five. Okay. Five All right. Exercise five. Sure. Yes. Okay, Exercise. Yes. Perfect. 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 Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Podría ser Dice. Jimena Susan. Ah, take many selfies. Students when they are working. Ajá. Sí, correcto, mm -hmm. perfecto. ¿Cuál es, cuál, cuál es la, la tres? ¿Cómo quedaría? Sería Jimena en Susan. Jimena. Shouldn't use phone in working hours, ¿verdad? Teacher, ¿cómo sería ahí? Use their, their phones, sí, ¿verdad? Para usar su de, de Ajá, ellos. Ajá, su de ellos. Yeah. Very good. De ellos. De ellos mm -hmm. sería. Sí, their phones. Their phones, yes. Their phones. When they, when they are working. <laughs> La siguiente es Pablo Post. The sign not a good time in his office door, so his team does not talk to him. Ah, pienso que podríamos usar post design que es post design como letrero cómo es teacher eh, cuál número perdón number four number four de las cinco ¿eh? Pablo uh -huh. post design sí la la eh, cómo se llama la cero sí la señalización uh -huh. No, no, good time, como uh -huh. se no es un buen momento. No, no. <laughs> o sea que no pueden entrar sí, porque no lo va a atender. <laughs> Así como no estoy para nadie en otras palabras. Y si, y si decimos... Mm -hmm. Y si decimos Pablo should keep calm. Perdón, puede ser también letrero o rótulo, sí. Eh, sign. Sí, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Ok. Pablo, Pablo should keep calm. Ah, es como calmarse, no sé si... Uh -huh. No sé si está, maybe, estará correcto. Or may, yeah, it's okay, but maybe you can say Pablo should be more tolerant, maybe. Ah, sí, sí. Mm -hmm. Pablo should... Eh, should be... Should be more tolerant. Ajá. Uh -huh. Pablo should be more tolerant. Con T al final. Yes, tolerant. Con T al yes. final. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Tolerant. La cinco dice Graciela always 
Sometimes. Sí. Y si quisiera decir. Graciela no debería. Graciela no debería. No debería. Signs. Eh, ¿Qué firma sería? Sí. Que firma los Siempre correos firma. con un emoji. Ajá. Ajá. Aquí podríamos decir Graciela. Sí. Ajá, pero en los formales. Pienso que especifiquemos que en los formales, ¿verdad? Graciela mm -hmm. should use eh, emo shouldn't use emojis in the formal emails. Graciela Graciela should shouldn't no debería shouldn't okay. use emojis. Okay. In the formal, in the, no, formal. In the emails. formal emails. Uh -huh. Nice. Bye. Very good. Mm -hmm. Ahora pasamos mm -hmm. a the last one. La, la última. Okay. And you say, class, sí. class, classify sí. this salutation and close <coughs> into formal or informal. Ah, muy bien. Yo quisiera escribirlo en la burbujita, pero no hay otra la opción burbujita. para escribir. <ríe> Teacher, ¿cómo hace usted para escribir? Uh, de, uh, ¿Cuándo está de... compartiendo? Ajá, porque ahorita yo me descargué el manual uh -huh. y la, en la computadora lo estoy viendo. ¿ve? Ah, ok. Lo váyase, tengo en el escritorio. Váyase a la barra, le voy a compartir por decirle um, el libro igual. Ajá. Eh, aquí, aquí dice, le sale una barra y arriba dice anotar, hay un lapicito. Ok, ahorita le veo. Le da clic ahí y le sale el ratón, o sea, luego la T de texto y ahí le da para, para escribir. ¿A dónde me dijo, perdón? En la barra ¿En de la los barra? iconos hay un lapicito donde dice anotar. Anotar. Ajá. Ok, ahorita lo voy a buscar, vamos a ver. Uh, anotar. Mm. Solo me sale vista de página, lectura de voz alta, dibujar, uh, res miren, resaltar. Miren, miren dibujar. En dibujar me parece solo un lapicito, pero. No eh, le sale texto, la T de texto. No. No. A saber por qué. Pero... Por aquí es de clasificar lo informal e informal, ¿verdad? Ajá. Sí. Eh, yo en lo formal he puesto best reward. Dear friend, uh -huh. and hello, mister. Son los tres he identificado. Ahora, si you debería ser formal. Hello, mister. Hello, mister and miss. Pienso que está bien como formal. Hello, mister and miss. miss uh -huh. Es formal. Dear friend, uh -huh. eh, sí o no. De es formal. Formal. Best regards, ¿verdad? Pero, pero, dear Best friend, ¿a quién le va a dirigir el correo? Ay, sí, es cierto. Uh -huh. Entonces, o sea, yo le puedo escribir a André Giovanni y le digo, dear friend, ¿verdad? Porque es Giovanni, pero si es mi jefe o el no. CEO, uh -huh. no va a decir, dear friend, ve así desde cuándo. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes, there was. Who are you? What's up? <laughs> uh -huh, go ahead. What's up? También. I don't know you. What? What's up? Is being informal. <laughs> así como super friends. Hey, what's up, Carlita? Uh, right. Go uh ahead. -huh. <laughs> hey, go hey, go también. Mhm. Mm hey, Cesar. Chocho. 
la última. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? ¿Cuál? Eh... La, ah, la e XO, XO. XO, XO. XO, XO. Ese es como eh, kisses and hugs o love and hugs, una cosa así como oh, casi como amor y paz. Pues. Sí. <laughs> That's very informal. Sí. Uh -huh. Sí. Which one, Perdón. Saul? T-H-N-X. Ah, that's an abbreviation for thanks. Es informal. Es informal, pero ¿qué, yeah. ¿qué se dice con eso? Eh, gracias. Thank you. Ah, ya, yeah, ya. Es yeah. una abreviación, Saul. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Thank you, thank you. Va, eso nos queda. See you, my best, y morning. Pero morning se está refiriendo como saludar de buenos días o... Ajá. O cómo se refiere ahí. Es como cuando se dice buenas. <risa> All right. Sí. So, si usted solo pone así como morning. Ajá, morning sí. es como... Entonces informal. Ajá, es informal. Uh -huh. My best, you see you now, my best. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, so finish, guys. Solo eh, nos quedan dos. Eh, cuando dice my best, ¿a qué se refiere ahí? Dice que yo creería es así como que, hey, así como, hey, mi super amigo, vea. Mm -hmm. So that would be like, o sea, teacher, eh, eh, uh -huh. in, the, in the formal salutation, uh -huh. eh, we have just two. Hello, Miss. Pretty much. Mm -hmm. And, and best regards. That's all. Okay. I think and, so. Quiero ver. Um, See you. What's up? Mr. and Miss, dear friend. Mr. Sí, de hecho, solo esos dos. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Las demás uh -huh. todas son informal. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. So you guys finish, right? All the exercises? Yes, yeah, okay, very good. We're going to go back, compartimos, y luego nos quedamos haciendo un review general eh, y terminamos clase hoy. Okay, guys, thank you. Teacher, a la mitad nos cogió. En serio, Marcos. Sí, no habíamos terminado, íbamos apenas. Oh, my goodness. ¿Y los demás? Bueno, yo ah, sé que el grupo de Carlita y el, ellos sí terminaron. ¿Los demás? No. ¿No han terminado? ¿No? No. No, sí, oh, no faltó una parte. No faltó la parte de... Y el teacher fue la número 5. Ok, bueno, no se preocupen, hagámoslo ahorita lo que tenemos y luego eh, van llenando ahí eh, lo que les hizo falta, ok. No dio tiempo para colocarlo en Google, teacher. Sorry, Qué bárbaro, teacher. Sorry, eh, Marcos. Teacher. <risa> lo siento, Marcos Werner, ya va otra vez. Yo pensé que ya no, eso lo dejo en el, en el módulo 1, Werner. <risa> ah, ya estuvo, teacher. No. <risa> Very good. Ok, intentémoslo aquí juntos. A ver. Uh, would you mind or could you? All right. Identify and correct three mistakes in the request below. A ver, Noemi, lea la primera y dígame si hay 
o no error. Would you mind moving your car? Is blocking mine. Uh -huh. uh, uh, it's not there. Error. There's no error, no mistake. No mistake. Oh, okay, very good. Todos están de acuerdo? No. Uh, the answer it block mine. Ajá. No sería así, sin el ING. No, de hecho, de hecho, it's okay, Magali, it's blocking. Okay. Uh -huh. Yo llego donde usted le digo, le importaría mover su carro. Está, está, uh -huh. está bloqueando el mío. Ah, uh -huh. okay. All right, yeah, so it's okay. Ajá, uh -huh. very good. Pero, Carla, ajá. Uh -huh. No, teacher, está bien, está bien. ¿Seguro? Sí, 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 está bien. ya no, ya no saqué la duda que teníamos. Ah, bueno. <laughs> All right, Carla, number two. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Carlita, Carlita, aló, aló, aló. Carla. Hoy sí me escuchan. Hoy sí. Hoy sí. Hoy sí. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> ok. En el número dos, you could feel this push ups order. Purchase, uh, purchase, purchase, purchase order. Uh, we have one mistake. Uh -huh. uh, the correct answer is could you Excellent. file this purchase order? Yes, purchase. 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 Yes, very good. Okay, so es una pregunta, right? It's a question. Entonces hay que darle vuelta. Could you fill this purchase Mucho. order? All right, very good. Okay. ¿Cómo la tenían así? Okay. Could you? Yes. Excellent. Very good. Number three, Werner, ya que lo escuché. Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, number three, teacher, uh, would you send this invitation to your assistant? Okay. Entonces, ¿qué, qué, le, qué le hizo ahí, um, Werner? Um, What did you do? Uh -huh. eh, para contestarle, teacher. O sea, yo le siento que está correcta la oración. Está correcta así como está. Would you send this invitation to your assistant? Uh, o le cambió algo, o le cambiaron algo en su grupo, o no. La uh, dejaron así. Ah, tendría que llevar ING, teacher. Pero ya lo lleva. Ah, ya lo lleva. Ah, pues no, entonces está correcto. No Ajá. sé. Y si entonces, no sé. ¿cómo nos queda, pues? Oh. Ayúdenme aquí, ilumínenme, ilumínenme. Would you Ajá. mind? Would you mind? Ah, would you ah, sí, mind pues, sending, sending this? Excellent. O sea, deje el sending, pero agréguele would you mind? ¿Verdad? Would you mind sending this invitation to your assistant? Very good. A ver, Juan Francisco, number four. Mm. Mm. Would you mind ordering somebody to it? Mm -hmm. uh, I think correct. correct. Yes, it's it correct. is. It is correct. Would you mind ordering something to eat? Very it's nice. Yes, eh, yes, Edgar, yes, Edgar, number five, please. Number five, could you uh, come tomorrow before? We need to call, welcome our visitor. Um, ¿Dónde está? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, que no, no le había leído la segunda parte. Perdón, Edgar. Ah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, es, uh -huh. Okay. Could you come? Excellent. Could you come? Very good. Yes. Could you come early tomorrow? Quítele el ING al verbo, ¿verdad? Porque estamos con It's el... Correct. All yeah. right. Yeah, okay. Could you come? Excellent, Edgar. Very nice. Let's see. Um, Juan... Ah, no, no, no. Francisco Javier, del ejercicio 4, number 4, exercise. Uh, would you mind turning the lights on? Mm -hmm. Okay, no problem. 
Excellent. Very nice. Thank you. Very good. Saul, number two. Saul, Saul. Could you order something to eat, please? Yes, I could. Okay. All right. Yes, I could. Oh, uh, la otra podría ser posibilidad también. No. Yes. Yeah, it's a possibility. Yo creo que podríamos irnos con las dos. De hecho, fíjese que en este tipo de preguntas podría haber, podría decir que la, la letra B es como más viable aún. Más directa. Okay. Más directa es aquello de que yo le pregunto a usted, ¿Could you order something to eat, please? Y usted me dice, yeah. It's okay. Y le diría, yeah, sure, go ahead. O sea, no sé, me da como que la, la B es como aún más correcta que la A, aunque la A could be okay. All right, very good. Let's see, Magali. Teacher. Yes. Pero Tell si me. dice, could you order something to your place? Yes, I could, but I don't can. Yes, I, I don't could. want. <laughs> yeah, I could. I mean, that's a possibility also. <laughs> yes, I could, but I can't. Oh, yes, I could, but I don't want to. Okay, yeah. I mean, between friends, Francisco, it's okay. <laughs> All right, but I mean, you wouldn't say that to your supervisor, right? <laughs> All right, very good. Thank you. Magali, number three. Could you request more jumbo paper clips, please? Uh, letter B, I could do it. Mm. All right. ¿Y los demás que tienen? Right away. Yeah, right away. Right away. Right away. Sí, right saben away. que si conté, excelente, de hecho sí, es right away. Si usted contesta, I could do it, es, podría hacerlo. Y me da la pauta que me va a decir, pero no tengo tiempo. Hmm. All right. Entonces ese I could do it suena así como podría, pero al final no lo voy a hacer. Por cualquier razón que sea. All right, mientras que el right away es inmediatamente. Okay, so that would be better. All right, Andres Giovanni, number four. Number four, would you mind getting 10 copies of this report in a minute? In a minute. Igual, no, I wouldn't, podría ser okay. Would you mind? No, I wouldn't mind. Okay, sure. But in a minute is better. Mariela, number five. Mariela, Mariela. Me, could you turn down the volume a uh, bit? Uh, yes, I could. Bye. Ah, all right. Excuse me. Could you turn down the volume a bit? Yeah, I think it's better when you say not a problem. Porque no, la no, otra, no. yes, I could. Si sí es correcta, gramaticalmente es correcta, porque usted está usando could en su pregunta y contesta yes, I could. Pero puede dar a, la, a lo que está diciendo Francisco Javier. Si sí pudiera, pero... Yes, I could, but I... But I don't want I to. I don't care. <laughs> Ajá. All right, so it's better to say, yeah, not a problem, I would do it. All right, mejor esa. Very good. Let's see. Okay. Thank you, Mariela. Very good. Number five, write suggestions about the following behaviors. Okay, let's see. Um, Marcos. Marcos, que está bien calladito, escondiéndose. ¿Dónde está Marcos? Que no lo veo. Aquí estoy, teacher. ¿Dónde está? En lo oscuro. No, aquí, levantando la mano. No me miro. <laughs> okay, Marcos, I'm sorry. A ver, yo le leo la, eh, la situación o el comportamiento y usted me da la sugerencia. All right? Okay. Sarah never stops chatting on the phone when we have lunch. Uh, Sarah should not use her phone. Excellent, Marcos. Uh, wow, Marcos, super. Ya le voy a regalar un sticker virtual. Es que es la única que hicimos, teacher. Ahí nos quedamos. Por eso salí. Excellent, very good. A ver, Noé. My boss does not like to walk to my desk when he needs something. He shouts at me from his desk. He shouts at me from his desk. Aha, uh -huh, Noemi, suggestion. Yes. Uh, the boss shouldn't shoot when he needs something. Okay, the boss shouldn't shout. Shouldn't? Shouldn't shout. 
Excellent. No, yeah, very nice. Thank you. Uh, yeah. All right. Or the ball, I don't know, the ball shouldn't be so lazy, right? A ver, um, Carla, Marta, Jimena and Susan take many selfies when they are working. Hmm. Uh -huh. Jimena and Susan <laughs> shouldn't use phones in working hours. Yes, very nice. Okay, Carla, very good. You can say in working hours or during working hours, okay? Very okay. good, thank you. Very good. Let's see. Um, Saul number four. Pablo posts the sign, not a good time, in his office door. So his team does not talk to him. Uh -huh, Saul, what is the suggestion? Pablo should be more tolerant. Excellent. All right. Pablo should be more tolerant. All right. Could be one possibility. And while <laughs> Graciela always signs her emails with the emoji. <laughs> Eh, no la hice, pero vamos a intentar. Of course. Eh, Graciela shouldn't use emoji in her email. Perfect, Juan Francisco. Excellent sentence. Thank you so much. Very good. Okay, guys, we have here, ya casi terminando, classify these salutations and closings into... Formal or informal. So we have formal, informal. All right. See you. What is see you? Formal or informal? Informal. Informal. All right. Informal. informal. Very good. Hey. Formal or informal? Informal. 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 What's up? <laughs> What's informal? up? Informal. Informal. Hello, Mister or Miss. Uh huh. Formal. 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 Formal, yes. Dear friend. Form. Formal. Formal. No. Friend. Informal. Usted le va a decir al sugerente, ah. al director ahí del Lindes, hey, dear friend. Si es mi amigo, sí. Claro, Marco Joseph. Yo sabía que me iba a decir. Right. Pero como es en, en working hours, Marcos, dígale. Ah, es, es informal. Es mi amigo. Very good. All right. A ver, la otra. My best. My best. Formal. Ajá. Formal o informal? Formal. Seguro. Okay. Informal. Informal. My best. Informal. Qué? My best buddy. My best friend. My best. <laughs> Supervisor, my best manager, my best. No, I think it's informal. All right, morning. Informal. In informal. Nosotros en español decimos buenas. All right. Y no decimos, no terminamos y buenas que noche, día, mañana, qué, right? Best regards, formal or informal? Formal. Formal. Formal, formal. very good. Ahí hay una abrevi abbreviation. Thanks. Thanks, thanks es la abreviación para thanks. Is it formal or informal? Informal. 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 All right. And XOXO. Besitos, besitos. Informal. A ver, Marcos, y eso es que no sabe. Ajá, kisses and hugs. Y eso porque no sabe, Marcos. Mejor ni me cuente, no vaya a ser. Very, very good, guys. Excellent. Ok, tomo la última asistencia de la noche. <laughs> oh my goodness. A ver, Andrés Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present teacher. Soy la Noemí Córdoba de Valencia. Present teacher. Yamilet Osorio Alfaro. Candelaria del Tránsito Martínez Cisneros. Edgar Alfredo Mejíbar Pineda. Present teacher. Carla Marta Cano Rivas. Aquí. Mayra Jasmine Rodríguez García, Omar Ramírez Vázquez, Fabiola Georgina Silva. ¿Qué le pasó a Fabi? No, no, ahí va invicta ya. A ver, Juan Francisco Enríquez González. Present teacher. Juan Francisco, se iba invicto, ¿verdad? Ya faltó una vez. Sí, sí creo que faltó una vez. Ay, ¿qué le pasó? <risa> El Cianet de María Ramírez Navarro también. Ella iba invicta. All right, Marcos Giovanni Morán Flores. Present teacher. Excellent. Werner Mauricio Reyes Ángel. Present teacher. 
Jennifer Magali Morales Guzmán. Present. Carlos Jonathan García Alvarado. We have Jorge Antonio Hernández Cruz. Ok. Eh, Francisco Javier Villatoro Canales. Present. Thank you. Mariela de Los Ángeles Alvarado Díaz. Present teacher. And Jose Saul González Roque. Present teacher. Excellent, guys. Very good. Solo recordarles antes de despedirnos de sus tareas, tienen que estar a la tarea número 15 ya hoy en la noche y mañana yo reviso, eso de las 2, 3 de la tarde estoy revisando para que tengan completas sus tareas hasta la tarea 15. La otra semana es la última semana completa. Eh, viernes va a ser el último día, pero les pedí a los compañeros por los que no estaban cuando di ese anuncio. Eh, la otra semana, por ser la última, sí vamos a tener que eh, hacer sus tareas un poquito como en advanced, porque también tienen su examen final, ¿verdad? Entonces tienen que tener completada no solo la sección 4, sino que su examen final para el último día de clases. Quiere decir que todo tiene que estar terminado jueves, ¿all right? Pero eso es igual en la semana, ¿verdad? Así es que me despido. Tengan un feliz fin de semana. I will see you on Monday. Si no tiene que salir, no salga. Quédese en casita y cuídese mucho. All right? Very good, guys. Right. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Bye. 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 Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Have a great See weekend. You. Bye Monday. now. Bye. 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 B